Hey guys, Kata here. Thanks so much for tuning in. Today's class is Crush Core, and that's right, we are going to crush your core. But we're not only talking abs. We add in things like inner thighs, hamstrings, and glutes to really get the center line of the body nice and strong. It's a quick class, just 30 minutes or so. It packs a really big punch though, so get ready to sweat and work hard. Grab a water, grab a towel, and then let's meet on your mat. Let's do this. We're gonna start today in a tabletop position. We're just gonna take a moment to kind of warm things up. So on your inhale, you'll dip your belly down, tip your tailbone up, look up. On your exhale, tuck your chin, round your shoulders, take cat. Inhale, cow, belly down, tailbone up, look up. Exhale, tuck your chin, round your shoulders, find cat. Take a few more here, and if you need to, add on a few little extra sways. Just kind of swing them around, a few circles, a couple rights, a couple left. Just working through some of that little sticky stuff that can sometimes show up. Maybe look over your right shoulder, look over your left shoulder. Just kind of get things turned on a little bit. If you haven't turned on your fitness tracker, let's turn that on too. All right, we're gonna get started right away. So plant your palms right underneath your shoulders. Tuck your toes under, take a nice big breath in, and on your exhale, float your knees off the mat. On your inhale, belly down, tailbone up, look up. On your exhale, tuck your chin, round your shoulders. Again, inhale, belly down, tailbone up, look up. Exhale, tuck your chin, round your shoulders. We're gonna do three more in this floating tabletop. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Last one, warming it up, inhale. Exhale. And then inhale, look forward. Now listen up. Take your left foot, hover it off the floor. Take your left hand, hover it off the floor. Inhale, you're in center. Exhale, you open out to the side. Oh yeah, inhale, center. Exhale, open. Let's do three more, three. Littles, wiggles, and shakes are good. Two. Last one, open, and then close, and really stay hovered. Just switch your body's weight. Pick up your left foot, pick up your right arm. Inhale, open, exhale, close. Inhale, open, exhale, close for three. Oh yeah, big breaths, two. Last one, and really sneeze down. Give yourself a little press into child's pose, let it go. And then we're gonna meet back in this tabletop position. So with your knees right over the tops of your, excuse me, underneath, knees underneath your hips, and shoulders right over the tops of your wrists, you'll take a nice big breath. And we're gonna start in this tabletop position, starting to right away to work on your glutes. So we'll get the timer started. You'll take a big bend in your knee, take a soft tap, and then drive. Soft tap, drive, and let's just start on the right side. Right here, we go straight up, soft tap down. Straight up, soft tap down. Now you can bring your palms flat to the floor or you can come down to your forearms if that feels more comfortable. But what I'm really looking for you to find is your abdominals are stabilized so you're not dipping into the low back. Keep the abs in strong and just drive up through your heel. Nice steady breaths, full, deep, strong. And we're gonna hit five more right here, five. We're gonna go all on the right side for four. Three, two, and keep your right leg lifted. Listen up, tap your knee off towards the left, let it sink down as low as you can. Maybe it even touches the floor, and then you'll drive up. Sink it down, off towards the left, drive up. Down, drive. Down, maybe it taps, drive. Good, big breaths. Drive up, let it sink. Drive. Ready? Yeah. Five more. Five. Four. Three. Two. And a one. Hold it up. Keep your right leg lifted. Now turn your right ankle to hover over your left. Flex your right foot really firmly. And you're just going to close, just like this, and then open. Close. Open. So ankle hovers, front right ankle hovers over the back of your left. Little turn out of the hip, and you're just gonna close, set your leg down, and then lift it back up. You're not actually setting the leg down. I want you to hover your right ankle over the top of your left ankle for five more. Four. 
three, two, and the last one, lift up, bring your heel to the ceiling, and you're just gonna draw circles. So big circle with your knee out to the side, and then back up to the ceiling. Trace giant circles with your knees. Back up, down, around, flip to the top. You got it, nice and slow. Big drive, last five. Lubricating the hip joint, building some strength through your glutes, just waking it up right away. Last three, we finish here. Switch to the other side, in, two. Oh yeah, there's another side. Last one. And then set it down. Let's do it on the other side. Big bend in your left knee, soft tap, drive straight to the ceiling. Soft tap, drive up. Tap to drive, tap and drive. Keep your abs in strong, push the floor away. Notice if your belly wants to sink and your our spine wants to arch. See if you can keep it nice and stable, nice and strong. Big breaths. Building the strength to stabilize the backside of your body. Super important for walking, running, sitting, all those important things that we do on the daily. Five more to finish, five, four, three, keep using your breath, two, last one, lift, and you'll take your left knee on the outside of your right calf, and then drive up. Dip over to the side, drive, dip, cross, drive and lift. Dip, cross, driving up. Cross to drive. Cross, lift and drive. Keep your abs in strong. Lift, drive. Big breaths, five, four, three, two, and one. Keep your leg lifted. This time left ankle hovers over the top of your right. Close, open, close, open, close. Good, keep it steady through your abs. Keep your breath full. Lift, hover, lift, hover. Big breaths, nice and strong. Good, you got five more here, five, four. We'll take it to those circles in three. Two, and one, keep the leg lifted, pivot to the ceiling, start to draw your circle. Up, out, squeeze at the top. Up, out, open, wrap, drive through your heel. Good, so nice, strong circles. Could be bigger, could be smaller, right? Depends on the lubrication in your hip and hip mobility, but you're working more of that mobility right here, drive. Hover it around, circle, push. Let's finish with five. Drive up. Four, lift and squeeze. Last three. Two more. Nice big push, last one, here we go. Close, circle, and then let it go. Give yourself a little press back to child's pose, and we're gonna meet on our backs. So you'll lay on your back, and we're just gonna take a boat series, so really strengthening the abdominals, building those stabilizers. There's gonna be some work through your hip flexors to get them strong, and it's gonna be good. So let's do it, we'll lay back. You'll start right here on your back. We're gonna do so many amazing things. You're gonna feel your abs, it's gonna be so good. Okay, let's go ahead and do this. So you'll lift and hover your legs off the mat. Shoulders hover off the mat and low back down. The height of your legs is gonna be completely up to you. What's most important, low back stays down. So keep your low back down, reach your fingertips forward, or you can always take a loose grip on the back of your head if you wanna support your head and your neck. You're here for 10, nine, eight, seven, breathe, six. Push down through your low back, five. Big, strong breaths for four. Three, two, hold. Now pull your right knee into your chest. Keep the left leg stationary. Stretch long. And then right knee pulls in. We're going to do 10 of these. So let's go for 10, 9, 8. Big breath, 7. Come on, here we go. 6. You got 5 more. 4, 3, 2, and last one in, stretch it long, meet with your left, hold it. Left knee comes in, right leg is stabilized. Stretch in and reach. You have 10 big breaths, 
Nine, find your breath. Eight, find your balance. Seven, come on, tell yourself you can. Six more. Five, drive down through your low back. Four more. You got three. Two, listen up. We're going to meet in this boat position. Last one, drive it out, hold it. Listen close. Knees in. Oh, yeah. And then drive them all the way back out. Let's go for ten. Big breaths. Nine. Whew. Eight. Nice big push. Seven. Six. We got five more. Four. In three. We'll go back to the top. Take a little breath in two. And then last one. Stretch it long. And then knees in. You can give yourself a little hug. We're going to jump right back in. So let's do it. Legs long. Low back down. Hold ten. Squeeze your glutes. Contract your quads. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Big breaths for five. Four. Three. Two. Hold it. Knee in. Ten. Just the right leg. Nine. Hold and breathe. Eight. Come on. Seven. Six. Working that six-pack muscle right here. Let us see. Let's see it. Five more. Four. Three. Two. And one to switch. Right leg stays stationary. Left knee comes in. Drive out. Focus on your breath. You have to start telling yourself that you can. The mental talk in your head is showing up in your body. You have five more here. Five. Stay focused with your breath. Four. Notice if your low back lifted, push it back down. Three. Two, and one, both legs long, knees in, find your breath, drive out. Ten, nine, keep your shoulder blades hovered off the mat. Eight, push. Come on, seven, strong breaths. Six, you got five more here. Four, three, last two. Last one, and then knees in. Give yourself a little squeeze. We do it again. We got time. We got one minute, 45 seconds left in this round. Here we go. Lift your head and shoulders, legs nice and strong. Hold 10, 9, 8, 7. Are your abs burning yet? Mine are so burning. 5, 4, 3, 2. Hold it. Right knee in. Come on. 10. Focus on your breath. 9. Tell yourself what you want, and then go get it. 7. Push, six, five, four more. Keep driving down through your low back. You got three. Stay with your breath, two. Tell yourself you can. Last one, hold it. Left in, lengthen. If you have to adjust the legs up a little bit, go for it. We've already been doing this for like three minutes, so it would be totally normal that you need to make a little adjustment. Five, come on, four. With your breath, three. Ooh, two more. Last one. Hold it. Both knees in. Big breath. Ooh, nine. Come on. That's eight. Here's seven. Ooh, six more. This is five. Big steady breaths. Four. Listen up. In three. We're going to go right back into the top because we've only got 20 seconds left. Two. Here we go, press down, hold, 10, 9, 8, 7, breathe, 6, 5, we're going to finish, 4, 3, 2, right knee in, stretch it long, 10, come on, 9, 8, 7, 5 more, come on, 4, 3, 2, I got to keep you even, stretch long through your right leg, go for 10 on the right, 10, this is it, 9, Big breaths, eight, seven, come on, six, five more, four, whew, three, two, and that's it. One last one in, out, and then release. Knees into your chest. Give yourself a little squeeze, a little hug. Those ones are always so good. Little shake if you need it, and we're going to turn on our side. So lay out nice and comfortably. 
And you'll bend your knees deeply and bring your heels together. Toes turn down so your heel can lift and then top toes turn up too. Make sure you roll your body's weight back so hip stacks on hip and knee on knee. Sometimes the hip wants to drop back. You get this nice little gap and then the knee might be able to open wider but you're bypassing some of that work. So stack your hips, firm up your belly, keep your upper body relaxed. Let's find motion clams. We start here, close and then open close and open. Nice and easy, right? You're just looking for your fullest range of motion. It might be different than me. It might be different than what you're used to. Just go for it right here. Let's go for 10, nine, eight, seven, six. You got five more here. Hold your belly in nice and strong. Four, three, in two, and then the last one, stretch your bottom leg long, top knee stays bent, you'll drive, dip it down like it could tap softly, and then you'll drive back on a diagonal. Knee comes down, tap, drive. Here we go, 10, drive, nine, push back, eight. So really press through your heel so you feel your glutes engage, seven, six, five more. Four, in three, two, you'll keep your right leg straight, hovered, and lifted. Last one, keep it lifted. Now listen up, keep your hips pretty stacked, back as far as you can, and then all the way out in front of you. Release, take it back as far as you can, make sure the hips stay stacked. And then you just bring it all the way out in front of you. You might need to use your hand or you'll fall, right? But if you can, you might be able to also do it without the hands. And then really forcing the abs to stabilize. Take your choice. Out long. Ask the abs to do the work. Bring it forward. Big breaths. Do your best to keep your hips stacked. We go for 10. Hand or no hand, right? Nine. You might play with it. You might get a couple in. Eight. Really firmly flex your foot too. Seven. Squeeze back, start to feel your glutes turn on. We're going for quality here. This is six. Five more. Ooh. Four. Three more. Squeeze back. Last two. And then the last one, just hold it out in front of you. Yeah, now draw circles. Whichever way, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Yeah, you feel that? Four, three, two, and one. That's it, switch sides. Here we go. Comfortably on, you can sit up taller, you can go down lower, bend your knees, toes down, heels up. Stack your hips, stack your knees, just the top leg. Opens and closes like a book. Hold your abs in strong. Open and close. Let's hit 10, 9, 8, 7. We got six more. Let's hit for five, four, three, two, and keep it lifted. Straighten your bottom leg. Knee tips down, soft tap, and then drive back on a diagonal. Bring it down, soft tap, drive back. Down, drive. Here we go, 10. Push through, nine, squeeze back. Eight, hold your abs in strong. Seven, push. Six, five more. We got four. Big steady breaths for three. Last two, and the last one, hold it back. Here we go, we rotate all the way to the front, and then all the way to the back. Keep your hips stationary, right? All the way to the front, maybe no hands. All the way back, big breaths. So chest isn't moving, chest stays stabilized. Just your leg is in motion, keep your hips stacked. Nice big breaths. Five. Almost thought I wasn't counting, huh? Four. 
Wouldn't be the first time. Three. Squeeze back, two more. We're gonna finish it off right here. Last one, we hold out to the front. Let's finish with your circles. You got 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. That's it, let it go. Give your knees a little squeeze, stretch that out, and we're gonna set up for a side plank. So we're gonna hit a little abs, little extra glutes, but you know, like why not, right? So we'll stack up for a forearm plank. Well, you got a couple options when it comes to this. So you can stack up for a straight forearm plank, shoulder over elbow, hips stack and hips up. If you need a modification, no problem. Bottom knee drops down, okay? You can stay from your forearm, but you can also come up, and up into the hand if that feels better for you. We'll get started in just one second. So take your choice. If you need to double up your mat at all, give yourself a little cushion. Make sure the hips stack, whether you go bent knee or legs straight. And we're gonna go for it. Nice and strong. Okay, here we are. Stack your shoulders, stack your hips, feet stack, or that bottom knee is bent. Take your choice, we're up and we're in it. So reach through your fingertips, stretch up nice and high. I'm just gonna take top leg and it'll open and then close. Open and close. Yep, we're here for five. Yeah, that's it, four. Nice big breaths, three, two, and then keep your leg lifted, draw circles, circle five, just five, four, three, two, and one. Feet come together, come into a forearm plank hold, stack your shoulders, stack your elbows, open up your feet about hip width. You'll dip from side to side, right to left. We got 10, nine, eight, push the floor away, seven, six more, Five. In four, we'll meet back in our forearm plank cold. We got three, two, and last one from right to left. We meet back. So you can go one at a time, knee taps, right? Alternating or both. We're gonna hit 10. Right to left is one, nine, yeah, eight. Come on, seven. Push it, six. Five, you have four, big breaths for three, two, and one. Release your knees, and we're just gonna switch sides. So left forearm down or opposite of what you just did. Take that bottom knee stacked or feet stacked. Here we go, hips up. Let's lift it up, reach through your fingertips, lift, open your top leg, close it back down. Here we go, open and close. You have 10, nine, Eight, seven, come on, six, five. Ooh, actually just five. There we go, hold it up there. Circle, five, four, three, two, and one. Keep it stacked, to bring it back to your plank. Nice and strong, hip dips again. Dip from right to left. Nine, eight, seven, Six, you got five, two minutes, 45 seconds left, four, three, two, big breaths, last one, right to left, here we go, meet in that plank, stabilize, one at a time, or both at the same time, 10, that's it, nine, come on, eight, seven, six, breathe, five, come on, four, three, two, and one. Set your knees down, give yourself a little press back. We'll transition to the other side, back to your right. Two minutes, 10 seconds left. Shoulder stack, hip stack. Bring it up, just the top legs in motion. Five, that's it. Four, three, two. Hold it up, draw your circles. Maybe the other way, five, four, three, two, one. Back to your forearm plank, hip dips. You hit 10, nine, eight, seven, oh yeah, six. Come on, five. If you need rest, you take it. If you need more, let's push. Three, two, and one. Right to left, back to your plank. Knees one at a time, or both. 10, let's finish. Nine, come on, eight, 
seven, breathe, six, five, four, whew, three, two, and one. Knees down, transition to the other side. Whew, good stuff. Always works, man. Okay, feet stack, hip stack, lift it up. Top leg, five, four, three, two, one, up, circle, five, four, three, two, and one to your plank. Forearm plank hold, hip dips, go, 10. More or less is up to you on that dip, nine. Come on, eight. Big breaths, just 40 seconds left. Seven, six, whew, five, come on, four more, three, two, last one, and then knee taps, come on, 10, let's push it out, nine, come on, eight, seven, we're gonna finish it out right here, six, big push, five, four, keep going, three, two, five more, five, come on, four, just move, three, two, one, you're done, push back, take a breath, let it go, big breath in, big breath out, Whew. that was a goodie, okay, we'll give your shoulders a little bit of a break, we're not giving your abs a break though, because it's ab Monday, I don't know if that's not a thing, it's a thing now, we're going to do it, so we'll start on our backs, thankfully, and we're gonna start with double leg circle. So both legs will stay together. Hands can create a nice little triangle to place underneath your hips, your low back. That's a nice little stabilizer, but you can always take the hands behind your head if you want a little more stabilization for the head and the neck. You can also release your head and neck to the mat, which is a nice option. And we're just gonna draw circles with our legs. So circle one direction, you know, and then remember, and we'll do it the other way. And we're gonna keep adding on after that. So take a couple of breaths. We're gonna get started in just a moment. So if you need water, if you need a little sip, a little swipe, we're gonna do this dang thing. We have this last round and then one final blast round and it's over, that's it. So send your legs up, let's finish this off. Finish off your abs, start with your circles. Just remember which way you're circling. We got 10, nine, eight, nice big breath, seven, Six, keep your low back connected to the mat. You can always lift your head and shoulders. Five more. Four. Here for a three. Two. And last one, both legs meet at the top. This time, open leg circle, so leg circle out, open together. 10, nine, eight, seven, Six, bigger or smaller, five, four, three, two. We're gonna meet up at that 90 point. Last one, up to 90, flutter kicks, but flutter low, flutter high, flutter low, flutter high. Let's go 10, all the way back up, nine, down. Back up, eight, oh yeah, seven, whew, big breaths. We got six, five, little flutters, four more, three, whew, nice and strong, tiny little kicks, last two. We're gonna meet back at the top one more time. Same flutter, just a little different. So at that flutter point, we go circles. Yeah, little flutter circles all the way around, 10. Here we go, just remember which direction you're going, nine. Eight more. Seven. Little flutters, six. Five. Nice and strong, keep breathing. Four more. Keep it up, keep it up. Three. Whew. Last two. And then you know we start from the top, right? Whew. Last one, let's finish it off. Two and a half minutes left, that's it. 
and then knees in. Give yourself a little hug. Let's do it again. Remember which way you did those straight leg circles together, and then we do it. Here we go. Circle. Down, up, around. Down, up, around. Ten. Head down or up is your choice. Nine. Eight. Seven. Legs are strong, meaning contract your quads, squeeze your thighs together, point your toes, or flex your feet. Five more. Four. Three. So you're building inner thigh strength, quad strength, and abs. Last two. And then the last one. Meet at the top. Both legs open. So down, up, around this time. Ten. Nine. Eight. Stay with your breath. Seven. Six. Five more. Four. Three. Two. And last one up, made it that 90. Flutter kicks, leg raise style. So flutter down low, flutter up high. Minute, 10 seconds left. Flutter, whoo, back up, flutter. Holy hip flexors, right? Burns so good. Down, back up. Tiny little flutters. Big steady breaths. So engage your quads, engage your glutes. Lift, 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 lift. And then lower, 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 lower. Here we go, five more, five. You can also flex your feet. That's a nice little option to switch it up. Four. Down, down, down. Three. Last two. Last one, we'll set up for those circles. Woo, to the top. Here we go, circle. Down and around, back up. Woo, 10. Here we go, nine. Big steady breaths, eight. Seven more, come on. Six, finish it out right here, five, woo. Last four. Big breaths, we got this, last three. Big push, come on. Big breaths, two more, here we go. Last two. All right, big finish right here, go. Last one, flutter, 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 find that circle. Make it good, make it good, all the way up, knees in, let it go. Knees into your chest, give yourself a little hug, a little shimmy, and then we're gonna finish it off with one last one minute blast. It's gonna be nice and easy. We're just gonna go for some bridges. So open up your feet a little wider, turn your toes out, nice and strong. I got one minute on the clock. We're gonna go bridge combo. It's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be fun. Let's turn it on. We go now. Here we go. Squeeze. Drive your hips towards the ceiling. Keep your knees wide over the tops of your feet. Make sure your feet are wider than your hips. 10 more here, 10. Squeeze for nine, eight, seven, six. You got five more, four. Come on, three. Two, keep your hips up there, drive high to your toes. So lift your heels, you might need to wiggle your feet in a little bit, listen up. Knees go close, and then out wide. Close, wide, so abduction, adduction, into the body, away from the body for 10. Squeeze out, nine. Keep your hips lifted, abs in, t seven, six, five. Keep breathing, four, three, and we finish. Two. Last little bit right here. Open your knees wide. Pulse out wide for 10, 9. This is it. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Hold it. 10. Squeeze. 9. Heels higher. 8, 7, 6, 5. Breathe. 4. You got this. 3, 2, and 1. You did it. Knees into your chest. Give yourself a hug. That's it. You made it. Squeeze your knees into your chest. Maybe wiggle around a little bit. You can take a little figure four. Right foot on top. Push into your right inner thigh, or maybe lift the left leg up and squeeze in. Just stretch out the hips a little bit. And then release and switch sides. Lift your right leg up, grab on. Little reclined pigeon to open up your hips. You can take a little twist, 
right or left, and just kind of release the low back a little bit, release your cervical spine, and you did it. Way to hit that blast. Just a half hour goes by really fast, but really packs a big punch. So give yourselves a little pat on the back, a little extra something special today. You guys did a killer job. Thanks for burning with me, and I'll see you all super soon. Have a great rest of your day. Thank you.